This is Governor Steve Bashir about Kentucky. Since 1955, parts or all of some 100 movies have been filmed in the Commonwealth of Kentucky. I'm talking about movies like Seabiscuit, Rain Man, Stripes, and Elizabethtown. These films, as well as related projects like commercials, documentaries, and Broadway shows, publicize some of what our state has to offer. But the productions also have a big economic impact. For instance, last year alone, movie producers spent $7.8 million on items like crew wages, location fees, set design materials, hotels, and catering services. But the film industry is a competitive business, and the decisions to film in a certain location often are made on the basis of financial and logistical considerations as much as on aesthetic and geographic factors. That's why I proposed and the legislature passed new incentives for the film industry as part of my economic incentives bill during the recent special session. The bill accomplished three significant objectives. One, it created a 15-member Kentucky Film Commission to help advise the Tourism, Arts, and Heritage Cabinet and to promote Kentucky as the location for film production. And two, it gave production companies flexibility on how their tax credits are applied. And finally, three, it lowered the spending threshold to bring in companies that make commercials, documentaries, and national touring Broadway productions in the bluegrass. We think it will greatly benefit the bluegrass state in the long run. Even in this tumultuous economic time, we have to make strategic investments and decisions that position Kentucky for growth and development. Film incentives are just one of the many actions my administration has taken to do just that. With our state's stunning natural beauty and unique culture, I'm excited about the many opportunities that will result from these new incentives. This is Governor Steve Bashir about Kentucky.